Hey everybody, how's it going? Welcome to another MAMG Let's Play of Black Winter. When we left off, uh, we just switched over from Matt to Lily, and I have no idea what I'm doing in my life. <laughs> What's this? It's candy. Yeah, let's take it. We're gonna take all of her candy. Can I go in here? Doesn't look like it. Okay. It's probably a door. Yep. Okay. So, yeah, when we left off, we found out that Matt is hiding some kind of secret, although I'm not 100% sure what it is. It's probably something evil and terrible. Hi! Emma, what are you doing here? Miss Lily, help me. The guard locked me up in this cell. <sighs> me and Matt had to take it separate ways. What happened? Did you find the key? Yes, but when I grabbed it, a door smashed against the floor immediately. That sucks. <laughs> like, oh, I'm sorry. But please, let me out of here. I'm terrified. There's an awful monster moving around here. Don't worry, Emma. I'll get out. Uh, I'll get you out. You'll see. I'll get out. You'll see. I've never been so scared in my whole life. I'm afraid to die down here. Emma, calm down. I'll find a way to get you out. By the way, what's that smell? What's in there? Monsters pee. Cool. What? <laughs> you heard me. A few hours ago, John freed a monster from a cell. The place was full of... Place was full of pee on the ground. Oh, the, the cell was. Got it. Disgusting. I'm gonna figure out something to get you out of here. Wait, please. Y yes? What is it, Emma? I'm so scared. I don't want to be here anymore. I know it's tough, Emma. Look, when I was your age, I was just as fearful as you. There was this weekend. My parents left me alone at the house. Longest three days of my entire life. I was locked. No relative calling home, neither the few friends I had. So yeah, you were by yourself, all alone. They put me in the guest room, I was grounded. Your parents left you for three days? What did you do to stay calm? Nothing. I knew I had to just face the fear by myself. I spent all the time there reading and praying for protection. Miss Lily, are you a religious person? You have a crucifix around your neck. Yeah. You know, something weird happened this weekend. Right, we're just gonna talk now? Okay, cool. Monster, though. That Friday night, I was really scared. I knew my parents were gonna punish me if I didn't wash the dishes, but I broke one by accident. They didn't believe me, and they thought I made it on purpose. If it wasn't for that, my parents would have taken me, taken me with them on a trip. Fear possessed me. It was the first time I was completely alone in the house. I would never forget it. Something happened. Oh, I'm supposed to move. What kind of parents just leaves their kids on vacation? Uh, here are some boring books. If only there were stories I could hang out with. My mom left this note. Lily, accept your punishment and show me that you're sorry for what you did. You're a very smart girl, but very insecure and impulsive. You must obey the rules. The rules, huh? The guest bed. It's very small and quite uncomfortable. I don't- uh, I will not sleep here anymore. Since we moved to this house, the windows are se Why- why would they bar the windows? It's stupid. At the other side, there's the main hall of the house. I can't see the outside. Maybe the previous owners had a good reason to do this. My mom sometimes forgets to water it, and then she scolds me for not doing so. Sounds like it's raining. There's nothing useful in this closet. Okay, I should not touch anything. I've learned my punishment. A fairly recent watch that my father bought. Clock, but... It's locked. How odd. What is happening? A very nice picture. I do not know what it means. It's very cold. It's a rainy day. I feel sorry for the animals without a home who are wandering around holding cold. Oh, she's worried about the animals. No? The bathroom... They locked the bathroom door? Okay, let's try this first door, because I didn't give it a try. Nope, okay. Why can't I open my bedroom door? Why? I heard a noise. A woman, freezing little by little. I could hear her deep breath. A cry for help in the distance. 
That would be so creepy. Then something crumbled or something. I was so afraid, I went back to my room and stayed in it until dawn. Okay. Since then, I became fearful and insecure, you know? Yeah, I bet! Loneliness was affecting me much more than anything else. Quite odd, but why don't you tell me already, Lily? Because you're a brave girl. You don't need this. You've been living in this castle for a long time. And you will overcome your fears. I'll give you a hand with that. Thank you. Before you go, take this. What is it? It's my lucky charm. Mr. Morgan gave it to me when I was seven. Y you might want to hold on to that if there's monsters and stuff. It's better for you to have it. You'll be protected with it. Thank you, Emma. But I don't think I can keep a monster away from eating me. Weren't you religious? Yes, Emma, but... Then where's your faith? Wow. Right here with God, not in an object. Mr. Morgan used to tell me God is within each, uh, each one of us. Here, take it. All right, Emma. Thank you. I'll get you out of here. You'll see. Thank you, Miss Lily. I think you'd be a great mother. Oh, don't, don't, don't. There, it's too soon for them. Really? Really. How do you know I don't already have children? Because a good mom wouldn't let their children be by themselves to come this far. Thanks, Emma. You're so sweet. Hang on, I'll get you out. Thanks. Why are you making me save? It's always a good sign when the game tells you you need to save. Pull the lever. I mean, it did just make me save. It's probably gonna kill me. Let's do it! I should hide myself fast. Sure. Oh, okay. Are you out? No? So... Locked. What What was the point of the lever? What was the point of the lever? I don't need to pull this anymore. What did we pull it for? I don't know. Okay. So, there's probably a monster lurking about now. Oh. Oh! This is open now. Okay. I think I might have done that. I'm sorry. I did not mean to freak anybody out by accident. An average skull. What is it doing in this tunnel? How weird. Oh, I bet it's not weird at all. I bet it's not weird at all. It's a box here. A small box, check it, yeah. Found X key and an apple, I'll take both. X key? No, no, please. Yeah, I'll get out. I'll get out of the tunnel. Somebody's like tapping on it. I don't know what the X key is, if that's a key for here? I mean, I also got an apple. Uh, will that key work? Nope, okay. Inside dungeons, huh? I didn't want to go too far. Ah, here we go. The door's been opened using its key. Um... Hmm. The door's locked from the other side, okay? What is this coffin doing here? Oh god. From its appearance, it looks like it's been designed centuries ago. There's a hole in the side. It seems I can open the coffin if I put a specific item in it. There's something over there eating those apples. 
Is that why you can throw stuff? Oh, it's a spider. That's a big old nasty spider. Okay. So, I wonder if there's anything else I needed in that tunnel. I might have to go back in there. Be a little bit braver than I am. <laughs> Alrighty. At least we have the X key. Um, oh, the door. Duh. Why was I trying to go through the crack in the wall? No more, no more thumpy thumps? It's a picture laying on the floor, check it. Sure. The prisoner who went mad, consequences of breaking the rules. Oh. So that's what he looks like, huh? Gotcha. Okay, well that still doesn't help me though. Um. I don't know if I need that poster, so I'm not going to save it right now. Is there anywhere else I can do something? Because there's this fella. Who, yeah, you're just a spider. Um, hmm. It says I need to put something- oh god, he's, he's right there. Ow. Okay. So what am I supposed to do? I can grab this. Which... Doesn't really help me much. Can I talk to Emma? Um, hmm. Well? Because it said I needed to, like, put something in the coffin, right? The door won't open. Okay. Yeah, so I'm not 100% sure what the uh, objective is here. There is there something else in here? That I missed? So, like, a door or... I don't know what that says, but thank you. I can't speak Spanish. I think it's Spanish. I'm pretty sure it's Spanish. Anyways, the point is, I'm lost and confused. Ah, there's a door over here. Okay. That makes a lot more sense. Oh, yay. Somebody's been eating a little good. I can't pass this column blocks away. Looks like I have to find the special item to put in the hole. Okay, so there's two items that we need right now. The jar is empty. Okay, there's a blue door. Some levers. Oh, jeez. Oh, I did not go this way. Kind of regret it. <laughs> Don't exactly know what's over here yet. Alright, so... The lever here too, locked. Sure. Anything? It just like pulled everything I could, but I don't. I don't know if it did anything. Oh, okay. It probably just does one at a time. The box is sealed. I need to... so many keys. We need. Okay, that's just a grape. I think. Um. Hmm. Ah, here we go. Okay. Get the grapes. Is there anything else? Uh, it's a note. Read it. Sure. Beware the fool with its mace. He can kill you with one or two blows. I suggest that if you come around these dungeons and you don't have a weapon which can be used for defense, the best option is to be quiet and walk calmly. Make a false move, a weak sound, and that fool will kill everything that moves. Okay. Looks like this creature died a while ago. The blood isn't dry yet. Check the corpse. Sure. Checking. 
Found an artificial school, shall I take it? Sure. Okay. So it's telling me not to run. Any, anybody? Somebody in here? Oh, okay, okay, gotcha. Alright, so, I got an artificial skull. Ugh. I just don't know which um, slot it's gonna go into, but I'm gonna save, because if that thing kills me in two hits, then I'm gonna be screwed. Alrighty. So, we're gonna go back, and I'm hoping it'll fit in the coffin, since it is a skull and it's very symbolic. And I won't have to go as far, <laughs> but we'll see. We'll see if the skull fits in the uh, in the coffin here. Yes. Hello. There's a key inside the coffin. Take it. Yes. Okay. So now we have a key. What? 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 No! 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 Nope, nope, nope. <laughs> Maybe I should go this way then. <laughs> God dang it. I think you saw me. <laughs> oh, jeez. Where is he? Oh, I see him. Okay. Whoa. Uh oh. It crashed. Well, give me a second. <laughs> Why'd it crash? Okay, this is a different room. Um, so I went up to the room upstairs and I figured I would just like book it before the monster got to me. You oh, it's this closet. Okay, so yeah, I was running away from him, but he was getting really close. So I found the doorway just straight down and I went through it. Stone hammer, I'll use it to break the skull. What skull? The... What? What what school are we trying to break? Cuz I don't remember a school needing needing to be broken. Um Not the one in the down there, is it? Oh, hi! Ouch! Okay, you are very strong, my friend. Sorry, I gotta go this way, though. Please don't chase me. Whew, okay. This skull? Sure. Artificial skull is added to the inventory. Oh, so you can use it more than once? Hmm, okay. Why would I want to break it, though? I don't think I want to break it yet, do I? Cause wasn't there one more thing that had like a round, but the, the monsters in there too. Uh, okay, you know what? Let's go ahead and eat an apple. Yeah, and feel a little bit better. We'll save, and then we'll crack the skull open. See what's in it, and then if I, if I need to, yes, I can restart it. Skull key inside. Okay, where do you go? Opens a sealed box. Which is probably where I was before. Um, in the other save room. So many keys to open so many things, huh? Alright, it's okay. We got this. Trust me. We got this. We just gotta make it through. And we will be a-okay. So up here, I'm gonna do the same thing. Just, if I trigger him, I trigger him. Go in here. We'll just wait it for a second. And now I can go back out. I probably could have made it, to be honest, but that's okay. No need to take any unnecessary risks. Okay, so up here. Boom. Yes. Dungeon Selkie. There we go. That's exactly what we needed. Alrighty. I'm gonna go back this way because it does seem to be a little bit shorter. Um, and I can save. Then we can take Emma with us, which I'm sure she's going to be very happy and thankful for. 
Alrighty. I don't know why the game crashed. Like, it... I, I, I have no idea. It just kind of did. <laughs> but that's okay. Sometimes it happens. Maybe I caused something to trigger that wasn't supposed to trigger. Who knows? But Emma's free, and that's all that matters. Yes. You are, like, actually Emma, right? <laughs> oh, Miss Lily, thank you. Thank you. I really appreciate it. I knew you would find a way to rescue me. Don't mention it, Emma. Now we gotta find Matt. Let's get the hell out of these dungeons. I knew my lucky charm would keep you safe. Well, it's not just the charm, Emma. To escape a roaming monster, I need guts. Here's your amulet. No, keep it. Don't leave it behind until you make it out with your husband. Okay, don't you want it? Fine, I'll keep it, but I'll give it back to you as soon as we leave. Can she not leave? Come on, Matt must be worried. Emma? Are you okay? I was thinking about the proposition you made me back in the garden. I changed my mind. What are you saying? I want to go with you. Do you really want to do that? Yes. You see, back at that cell, I realized I don't want to stay here forever. And of course, not with a guy like John around. If that's what you want, Emma, we'd be pleased. Can I really go with you? Of course, Emma. You don't have a place and we can give you one. Just look around you. This is no place for a girl like you. Thank you so much, Miss Lily. You don't have any idea how happy you make me feel. I'm really happy too. Matt and I never had children. And it's not because we don't want to, but because we... Well, it's a bit complicated. Let's just say that. We're unable to. We'd be really happy to adopt you, Emma. You're a kind-hearted girl, and so mature, too. Yes, that makes me so happy. If Morgan abandons you, we won't. You'll finally have a real family. But we have to think about how to get out of here. Take this key. I found it in my cell. Could do uh, for one of the doors nearby. Dungeon exit key was added to inventory. Thanks. Let's go. I'll follow you anywhere, Miss Lily. Thank you. Thank you kindly. Come on. There's no time to waste. Okay. Anything in here that we need? Aw, she's with us now. She's so cute. I don't think she's gonna make it, though. I don't know. Just something about the fact that, like, she's letting us keep all this stuff and, like, how she's talking about how she's changed her mind. Um, you know, because John was saying after 30 minutes, if they're outside for too long, they die. Um, and I don't know if Emma's had to eat the flesh like other people have. The door won't open. Oh. Well then, that's not the exit, huh? Um, yeah, I don't know if she'd had to eat the flesh like the other ones have, but... Oh, this isn't where I want to be. No, I'm taking Emma to all the weird places. Okay, so dungeon exit key. Um, is it... Up in that room where I haven't gone, um, straight up yet. Because if so, then we may be in some trouble. Okay. Here we go. Full health. Because we're going to need it. I'm going to have to run up past him. I think. Yep, there he is. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Oh, ow. 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 Please. Please don't break my bones. Go, go, go. Door unlocked. Yes, go in. Ha ha ha! That was where we- oh! That's where we needed to go, alright! I opened the door from the side. Yeah, but why is it so red? Save? I have 37 save slots. I know the cellar. A while ago, Matt and I came around here. Yes, from here we can go up and get to a kind of a warehouse. We'll be at the castle first floor. I wish we could find Matt soon. Time's running out. I would like to have your courage so I could face the monsters in this castle. Well, Emma, all human beings fear something. I admit that there are days when I was a scaredy cat and a crybaby or history. When you grow up, you don't only become more mature, but you also overcome your fears, though not all of them. And what is it that you fear the most? Losing Matt. I don't know what I would do without him. He's my whole life. He's not only my husband, but also my friend. With him, I find someone that listens to me and encourages me to keep moving on. 
I'm very afraid of mis losing Mr. Morgan. He's my only family. It's been months since I don't uh it's been months since I don't know anything about him. Mr. Morgan always treated me very well. He took care of me as if I was his own child. And one night he told me something that I never told anyone. I hope you can keep that secret, Miss Lily. Of course, Emma. Tell me. I'll keep your secret. It happened three years ago. What's his secret? I wanna know. Who wrote help me on the chalkboard over there? Emma, I beckoned you here today because there's something important I wanted to talk to you. I'm eager to listen to it. You've taught me so much. Before I do it, I need you to bring me some ingredients. What, what would those be? It's called cursed fluid. It's let out by the beasts of this castle every week, but only by the ones who were victims of a curse. Does that have something to do with their pee? Gross. No. It's like a punishment. It looks like sweat, and each time they drop it, they feel pain. Ooh. Alright, check. What else do you need? Second thing we're gonna need is meat. Human meat, to be exact. That's it. What? Calm down, Emma. You're not going to kill anybody. You'll find it over one of the balconies. What? Why? What happened there? Do you remember the madman? Before I- before he turned, I cut off his stomach. Poor man. Why did you do that, sir? It's a monster, Emma. Don't mind him. You'll cook a very special meal with his flesh. For what? I'll tell you when you bring me the ingredients. Where do I find the cursed fluid? You have to look for it here, over the third floor. I'm proving you, Emma. This is how you face your fears. Someday, I won't be here anymore, and I need you to be strong. To be able to live in this castle, fearless. No, Mr. Morgan. I don't want you to die. I know, Emma, but no one can avoid death. Come on, bring those ingredients and hurry, please. Any advice? No, but remember it's all on the third floor. You don't have to go anywhere else. Thank you, Mr. Morgan. I'll get on with it right away. I'll be waiting for you. Okay. Oh, and we have to play as her. Yay! Just the plant. Um, it's a picture. Check it. Sure. Brennenberg Castle? Is that another monster reference I don't get? The storehouse is locked, it requires a key. I don't know. Well, here's the balcony. There's a paper with scribbles. I can only understand the following letters. M-A-W-L-D-E... Something? What? No matter what you do... I don't know. Weird. Yeah, I agree. There's the meat. Raw meat, yeah. Okay, anything else we need here? No? Why do I feel like I'm gonna die? <laughs> of course, I can't. I mean, I'm Emma, so this is a flashback story. Their only cleaning tool is nothing important right now. Um, over here, I guess? The weird, like, punishment fluid? These papers say the following, monthly expenses, 458XXX, public services, 684, monthly food boxes that have been spoiled, 3, Otros expenses, oh god, extra services, expensive place, a mechanism's blocking the door, okay, locker sealed, there's no way to open it, um, hmm. What in the world is happening? The mechanism's blocked. Ah, so many things are blocked! Curse fluid, take it. Sure. Locked. Okay. I got the things. Should I check this door up here? The door that leads to the east wing balcony is locked. It requires a key. That's fine. I think they locked a lot of the places so that we don't have to deal with it. Or 
maybe we're gonna go to the third floor later. Who knows? I have no idea how long this game is. I'm actually really surprised that it's as long as it is and not- Not complaining at all. Just, you know, it was all good and such. Okay. <laughs> Sir, here they are. Good job, Emma. Did you have any problems finding them? No, sir. It was a piece of cake, really. You could have done it yourself. I found that monster, but he walked off. I wasn't scared. I was! Let's go to the kitchen to prepare the special meal. What's this all about, sir? You're making me curious. Emma, there's something you need to know. This meal will be made for an upcoming visitor. Who is that? I am old, and I need someone strong and brave to watch the castle. That's why I'm hiring a man to do the job. Is he gonna take care of me too? No, Emma. You can take care of yourself. In a week, this person will show up. He will live here with us. He's gonna watch out for any trespassers. You still haven't told me why we're cooking this. What's this special meal for? This will turn... Uh, into some kind of mutagen that I will give our gr our guard when he when the time comes You have to keep this a secret and we must make sure he eats it So see they tricked him into it. What for sir? To make him immortal What? Yes, Emma, it's the only way he could be a guard at this castle Otherwise the monsters could end his life You know very well that the creatures around here are not very friendly we are not safe here since the curse. That's why I had to lock them in the dungeons. Some have fleed the basement to the sewers, but that would be the guard's problem. What happens if he finds out we lied to him? Sooner or later he'll figure it out that he's unable to die by natural means. I know, Emma. Let me take care of that. Anyways, the mutagen will not be enough. I'll make him stay in the castle's most dangerous room. The sign on it attracts such a powerful energy that it will turn him immortal. He'll be our guard and protector. For some, it may not be a punishment, but a gift. Depends on which way you look at it. But I have a feeling that for this one, it will be a punishment. How do you know that, sir? Because I'm aware of his weak spot. I know exactly what his motivations are and his desires and what makes him the perfect applicant to the new castle to be the new castle guard the new one yes he is not the first nor the last i was a guard myself before all the family members that lived in this castle died one of them gave me a job so you're not the proper owner of the castle no emma the real owners died a while before this unusual circumstance. The worst thing is, I'm cursed too. And what's your punishment, sir? Please don't tell me you're going to die soon. <laughs> Emma, we're all gonna die sooner or later. Except for the guard. I can't tell you my, <clears throat> my punishment right now. You wouldn't understand it. I'll tell you when the time comes. Let's prepare this mutagen. Okay, sir. Cooking is one of my favorite hobbies, so I'm pleased. I know, Emma. I'll do my best. I appreciate that. Okay. A little bit longer than I realized, but that's cool. I wanted to know what the story was, so. So, because of you and Morgan, John is immortal. Unfortunately, yes. How ironic. But now we can't go back in time. We have to think of how we will get rid of John. Yes, you're right. Thanks for telling me this, Emma. Please, don't tell Mr. Matt. He might not take it too well and become mad at me. Don't worry, Emma. I know how to keep secrets. Do you now? Come on. We need to find Matt. I hope he's around here. All right. Can I save? I'd like to save. Oh, Matt has to be here somewhere. Would you mind reminding me why, uh, did you two get away from each other? 
Because of that puzzle trap at the dungeons. Why is this place filled with those things, Emma? I'll tell you if I knew. Morgan would know the answer to that. But you know he's long gone now. What about John? He should know. We don't get along pretty well. My guess is they exist to prevent the beasts from escaping. You're talking about the monsters in those cells? You got it. If you really want to come with us, you're going to have to spit out everything you know about this place. Sure, let's find your husband first, if you don't mind. There's no need for that. Here I am. Oh, yay! We're reunited! Matt! I'm so happy to see you, honey. Didn't you bump into that John bastard? No, darling. Fortunately, I didn't have much problem finding my way out of the dungeons. I mean, our way. It's all thanks to her. Don't thank me, lady. You were the one who set me free. Set you free? What were you doing down there, Emma? John locked her up in the cell, but I rescued her. Thank God. How are you, Matt? Did you find this guy? Did you get any phone calls from the company? No, but I did find John. You won't believe what he told me. What did he tell you, Matt? I'll tell you everything in a moment. We gotta find him first. Emma, do you have any idea on where he might be? He could be anywhere, but we could win some time, Mr. Matt. Doing what exactly? I know where John's truck is. It's in good condition and has enough fuel. Perfect. Let's roll. Okay. Um. Whoa, 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 whoa. It's here. You'll find the backyard going through this door. The truck is nearby. Wait a minute, Emma. I want to know on which side are you? My God, Matt. Wow, how could she do that? She was locked in a cell. Don't you get it? John locked her up in the cell and I wouldn't have rescued her. Who knows what would have happened? Mr. Matt, I understand your concern. I should have told you the situation here. But we still have two hours left. When I talked to John, he told me something about the rules of the curse. What did he tell you, Matt? He told me that if we took longer than 30 minutes in getting out, we would die. Is that true, Emma? I don't know, really. Since Morgan left, John's been cursed and he's never left the castle in a long time. Good. Let's go get the truck. Okay. We are saving. Alrighty. So that is the end of this episode here. Thank you guys so much for watching. Let me know if you enjoyed. I'll see you guys on the next MAMJ. Let's play. Oh. Hello, Matt. I've been looking for you. Hello, Morgan. Or should I say John? Dude, I suggest you change your weapon. Those bullets take me. What? How? Is that possible? Okay. I should have killed you. You know very little about this place. You're barely starting to dive into the dark secrets hidden in this castle. 